Here we go again. Welcome back to another episode of Destination F. We have lift off, twist, turn. Oh, how's your spinal cord? What's happened to the cameraman, though? Honestly, I'm going to go ahead and need to hear the original audio for that. <laughs> doing me job, doing me job. Shit, I overdid me job. Oh, he stacked it as well. This video was sent in by Bernie. Cheers, mate. Submit at aussieman.com. The new staff member is like... What happened, Bernie? Nothing, Katie. Clearly nothing happened. I don't know. It looks like something happened. She calls everyone else over. They're like, yeah, it didn't look like this before. Bernie yells, why the fuck do we have so many staff on today? This one was sent in by Ryan in Canada. He's looking to launch his own backyard adventure park. Let's see how the zipline ride goes. Oh, gee whiz. I wouldn't do it if I was scared of heights. He sticks the landing. Oh, look out for the tree. Oh, that was destination almost fucked. A close call. At least he's sorted out the Christmas tree. For December, that's good. These Sheilas are ready to hit the beach. Just doing final checks and BAM! All over your face! Wowee, Sheila on Sheila pranks. A fair dinkum ruthless. I guess we can call this one the make your friend smell like a fucking alcoholic prank. She downs it. Oh no, 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 no! I'm sick of driving. Too many things can go wrong. Someone invent teleportation already, please. It was a regular sunny day in the neighborhood, like any other day. Three, two, one, BAM! Destination fucked! Three, two, one, BAM! Destination fucked! You know you want it. He's okay. What I love about this video is that he knows he's being recorded. Is he going to ask them to delete the footage? Nah. Is he going to ask them not to laugh at him? No. No, he's not. Hey, I don't know if anybody's home, but if you recorded that, um... Send me a video, please. He's gonna ask them to send him his own copy. Fuck yes, Segway guy. Fuck yes. Frank and Paul submitted this one to me. They reckon they're getting really good at kayaking and decided it was time to film their awesome tricks. The main trick Paul knows is destination fucked. Yeah, nah, yeah, he can do that one super duper well. I reckon someone will sponsor them. Take the long way. Just take the long way around, mate. This blissful puddle is an illusion. It's eyes oh, vanished. The destination F gods will do that to you. They'll make something look nice and inviting and safe and then... <laughs> You're gone. They've got you. That's how they get you. It's a trap. Here's Aaron's dad. He's using the tradie entrance and exit, and he's going to regret it. He was not wearing the appropriate safety helmet. It's actually nice when people don't fight back against Destination Eft. They lay down, think about their actions, and slowly accept it. Slow down, Jono. Don't, no need to rush. Fucked. His footwear tries to get away from the accident. Yeah, no, yeah, like Aaron's dad whacking his head on the garage, Jono is just going to lay down for a while and accept his fate. The kids are like, why do dads always hurt themselves? It's a good question. It genuinely is. Anyway, every great instalment of Destination Fucked should end on a bicycle crash. If it's in slow motion, it's usually always better. Davo, what have you done? You're probably a dad as well. This has big dad hurting himself energy, this crash. Yep, he's arrived. He's booked a hotel at his favourite destination. Absolutely, please do send in the videos you've shot yourself to submit at aussieman.com. We might even pay you some beer money. And check out aussiemanshop.com because I have ordered more audio keychains. We've got a fuckload more, so snap them up, snap them up. Link in the post description below.